we saw we saw Santa ones, but like I don't want to put my spatula on a Santa. I want to put on a normal spoon rest. The shelf is shelfing, y'all. Isn't this a beautiful shelf? We're in a new house. New things are happening. The holidays are coming. December is coming. Winter is happening. There's just a lot going on, but I'm all for it. But it has a little snowman. Frosty the snowman. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. Welcome to another Moving 101 episode. I don't even know how much, so I'll just put the number on the screen. Welcome to another Moving Vlog episode. Um, in between the last episode, I've been doing um, a new series called Living with Sue because now the house is like 99% done. There's just a couple things in the office and the gym which is almost done and will be done in this vlog so yeah in this episode i'm going to show you guys a tour of my garage gym and i'm very excited because y'all know i value working out being healthy and working on bettering myself and my health also i'm going to bring you guys along a couple days in my life because i just i just want to bring you along y'all are my besties so yeah, today so far I've eaten breakfast and I've gotten some work done. Um, so yeah, yesterday I went thrifting with my mom and I thought I'd show you guys some things. I got some new books. So I got this whole collection of mangas. This series is called The Esperanza. So I'm excited to read these books. They look like this. And then I got some uh, graphic novels that I used to read as a kid. Um, so yeah, I got a bunch of new books. I actually got like... 10 books and they were like a dollar each and it was just iconic so yeah i also got two christmas mugs which i'll show you guys downstairs and i'm actually going to go downstairs to eat some lunch but i wanted to kind of catch you guys up the itinerary for today i'm going to be going to walmart and the dollar store and start getting stuff for christmas and do my groceries and me and my best friend are going to go together so that's going to be fun some things i'm going to show some things i'm not because i'll be putting it more in my vlogmas so stay tuned for that as well so there's a lot going on we're in a new house new things are happening the holidays are coming december is coming winter is happening there's just a lot going on but i'm all for it so anyways i'm gonna go eat lunch and i'll show you guys the two months that i got from the thrift store yesterday also the shelf is shelfing Y'all, isn't this a beautiful shelf? I might as well show you some new additions. I ended up building this beautiful downtown and I added it beside this farm, which just kind of just puts everything together. The shelves are really filling up and y'all know I have an obsession with Legos, as you can see, and I have, of course, more Legos coming. So yeah, the shelf is getting more full with books and Legos and I'm obsessed. Anyways, I'm hungry. I'm gonna go eat. All right, I'm in the kitchen. I'm gonna be making lunch, but before I do that, I wanted to show you the two mugs that I thrifted yesterday. So we just saw these boxes and it said, happy holidays, and I was like, what is in it? Um, and it's beautiful mugs. Y'all know I love me some clear mugs and I found some nice holiday mugs. I Every holiday, I collect a bunch of like Christmas mugs and cups and stuff, but we have this cute one. It says happy holidays with a little Santa. I know the lighting's not the best, but you can kind of see. And it like spins and stuff and it's so cute. So I saw that one and I got it for $6. Um, but with my mom's discount, I actually got it for $4. So that's pretty cool. Um, no, literally I went to the thrift store and got so many deals. Like I got all my books that I showed you guys for like a dollar and got these mugs for four dollars actually so it was just a great thrift day then the second mug i got which is the same mug but it has a little snowman frosty the snowman so cute so cute so yeah and it spins as well so got that thrift the thrift store has been so great for me and has been i've just been so lucky with it and that's been great i also got and am getting more christmas things but i'll show you guys that more in vlogmas because that's all holiday stuff 
I'm crying. I'm crying. Anyways, I'm going to try to make lunch. I'm not quite sure what I want to eat. But we just got a lot of things going on and things to do. So, yeah. Plan for the rest of the day. Eat. Continue doing some work. Then going grocery shopping slash slash just shopping. You know, we love good shopping. Anyways, I don't even know what I want to eat for lunch. I'm a little scattered a little bit, but we're gonna we're gonna situate ourselves. Let's do it. Hey guys, I just finished lunch and I didn't even show you guys because I was so hungry I just scarfed it down. So yeah, but I just ate a frozen dinner and cereal. Super random, but it was good and it was devoured. Now I'm gonna do some dishes and then get back to doing some computer work. So I don't have too much dishes to do and put away. Get this done and then get cranky. I'm so excited. Me and my best friend, we were texting about like, what's our game plan for tonight? We're gonna go to the dollar store and then Walmart. Well, actually we're gonna go to the dollar store and then we're gonna eat McDonald's at the Walmart. Then we're going to Walmart. And I have groceries I need, some one thing from, I have one thing for the gym that I want to get and then that'll be like basically complete. And then I have groceries, Christmas stuff that I want to get. And I'm just excited. And also, I just love hanging out with my best friend. So, yeah, we have a fun jam-packed day. We are almost, we're kind of like halfway through, well, one-third, half through the day. And honestly, it's been going kind of quick. Um, so, yeah. Anyway, so let's get some dishes done. Hey guys, so I'm back from doing some shopping with my best friend. We went to the dollar store, ate some McDonald's at a Walmart, and then we did some grocery slash Christmas shopping at Walmart. I got a bunch of Christmas stuff, but I will not be showing it in this vlog slash episode. That will be in Vlogmas. If you guys didn't know, I'll be vlogging basically all of December, so stay tuned for that. The only Christmas thing that I will be showing is is I got this North Pole battery operated train and I was thinking of putting this train around my Lego Christmas town that will be near my Christmas tree. I thought it was so cool and I saw it and it was one of the like last ones at Walmart so I got it and I'm excited to see it go around the town. Um, I still need to get the batteries for that, the D batteries. I don't think I've ever used them. So I do need to get that, but we will be decorating and doing all that kind of good stuff in Vlogmas. So stay tuned for that. But I'm excited and I, I'm i really going to be in the festive mood. So that is the only like Christmassy-ish thing that I'm going to be showing really. But yeah, I'm very excited for that. Rest things I'm going to show is like grocery slash miscellaneous. Um, first thing I got were these orange juices, the great value ones. First of all, they're really good and they're like a dollar each, which we love. And I think I got an apple juice as well, or maybe I just got orange juice. Got two of these. Next item is not grocery related. I got two extra sets of hangers because you guys know I've been organizing my Depop clothes, so clothes that I want to sell on Depop. And I needed some more hangers and I needed some more hangers. So I got two sets of hangers. So that's cool might seem like a lot of hangers but I do have a lot of clothes that I'm going to be selling on Depop so yeah at the dollar store I got this spoon rest because I didn't have one when it comes to like you know when you have like your cooking and you want to put down the spatula I've been putting it like on a paper towel or like on the counter but this is just so much better me and my best friend we saw we saw Santa ones but like I don't want to put my spatula on a Santa I want to put on a normal spoon rest so I got a normal one. It's silver. Um, me and my mom saw a white one at the thrift store, but my, as you can see, like my kitchen is more like brown, black, and silver. So this one matches way better and I will be keeping it close to the oven. I'm gonna show a couple frozen things cause I just wanna put them quickly in the freezer. But I got this big pack of pork breakfast sausages. There's 28 and this usually lasts me like months. So I got a big pack of those. 
I got my gyoza dumplings. I usually get the big pack at Costco, but until I can go to Costco, I get just like a few of those. I got a few frozen dinners. I don't always get them, but sometimes for lunch in midday, I just do a quick dinner like that um, if I don't have time to make anything. And also it's just quick, but I don't eat them often because they do have a lot of salt, which isn't that great. So I'm gonna go put those in the freezer. Then I got my favorite coffee, the caramel macchiato. Y'all know I love. I got some more little frozen dinners. I got a chicken pot pie. I got pizza pocket. These are just like quick lunches when I really don't have time. So I got those. I got these packs of uh, Uncle Ben's jasmine rice. I don't really use rice very often. And these ones are just quick. You put in the microwave. So I just got a few of those so that if I ever need like a quick little rice with my dinner, I can just heat that up. Next things that I got are also miscellaneous. I got a plunger, is that what it's called? I got a plunger because I realized I don't have one and you never know, so I got one. It was really hard to find, but yeah, got that. Then I think I showed you guys last episode of vlog. Um, in another vlog, I showed you guys putting up my poster with these clips and I got one to try it out. I really loved it. So I got two more for my two other Billie Eilish posters in my bedroom. So I got two more. So got that. Very excited to put that in my bedroom. Um, I got I got this. It's a gift. So I'm not going to talk too much about it. Um, I got some maple syrup for whenever I want to make pancakes. And also, did y'all realize that like Aunt Jemima ain't, ain't Aunt Jemima anymore and it's pearl mining. What? Pearl milling? Miling? It's Pearl Miling Company. I did not I did not know that. But anyways, got that. Then I found so many cute bath bombs, and y'all know I love to take my bath. Um, some of these from the dollar store, and I think one of them's from Walmart. So I got this lavender one like this, and it's in a heart shape. I got this blueberry one also from the dollar store, and then I got this one from Walmart, which is just gorgeous. So got those and I'm excited to take a nice bath. And then I also got a big thing of bath bombs. Um, and I'm so excited. I think it's a gift set, so I kind of technically am gifting it to myself. Um, there's so many cool um, flavors or scents, I should say. And there was like a scratch and sniff and I just couldn't resist. Oh, it smells so good. So we have lemon and lime. Ocean Waves, Strawberry and Cream, Lavender Dreams, Rose Petals, Vanilla Sugar, Cherry Blossom, Coconut Macaroon, and Beach Vacay. Oh, I'm gonna take some nice baths with that. I also got some Christmas cookies. I thought it could be fun with some friends. Um, we can make Christmas cookies and stuff like that. Um, I got this little Reese Christmas chocolate. I don't know, it was super cute. Um, I got my usual little ornaments because y'all know I'm doing like a whole collection and I'm going to be putting them on my Christmas tree. I'm getting my Christmas tree this week so that's going to be fun. Then I got some Activia Strawberry Immune System Shots. I get these anytime I find them. Um, I got these cookies for a gift. I got two packs of shredded cheese because it was there was a sale for two so I got that and I always use that in my eggs and stuff. I got a creamy Alfredo pasta kit, so I'm gonna put that in the freezer. Then I got some fruit roll-ups. These are a nice little um, snack that remind me of my childhood. I got a great value apple sauce. No, it's not an apple sauce. I got a great value apple juice, and it's literally a dollar, and I love it. And I usually like chug it. I usually use the juices as like a chaser after my ginger shots, cause I'm a wimp when it comes to spicy. I'm a wimp. So yeah, then I got my canola oil spray oil. I love it when it comes to cooking. I got my applesauce pouches. These are nice snacks. I always get like two, three, and I put it in my fridge. I'll put it here. I got these chocolates to try. I don't know if I'm gonna like it, but I wanted to try, and honestly, I wanna make my family try it too. It's Peppermint Bark by Ghirardelli. I don't know, looks cute, and it comes in little packages, so I thought I could try it um, and make other people try it too and maybe add a couple ones in people's gifts or just give it to them. So I thought it could be fun and cute and it's very much holiday. So I'm excited for that. Then I got these Nature Valley Crunchy Granola Bars. This is in the flavor Own Honey and I used to love these when I was younger. So I thought I could have them as like a nice easy snack. 
So got these. I got a pack of eggs, which I'm gonna put them in my egg container to put in the fridge. And then lastly, I got a case of water and they're in these cute little water bottles. So when guests come over, I can give them some. So I'm gonna be also putting them in my little organizer to put in the fridge. I'm gonna put away everything that I showed you guys. You put all my Christmas stuff that I bought in a bin, which I will give you guys a haul in Vlogmas. And also I'll be taking them out when it comes to decorating for Christmas and stuff. So I'm gonna organize a couple things for the fridge and put things away. Also, it is already 10 p.m. The time is flying, girl. Ever since I moved here, one, I've had the best luck, which I love it. And two, time has passed so quick like so quick it's already been like two months since i've lived here right because we're in november yeah it's almost been two months and in like two weeks it'll be almost three months isn't that crazy time is passing by but anyways let's get a little bit more organized let's get situated oh also i bought the last little item that i was missing for the gym but i will not show you guys because in this episode, I'll give you guys a whole tour of my garage gym. I've just been a little bit scattered all over the place. Let's get organized and I gotta go to bed. But yo, yeah, let's get organized. Hey guys, um, I finished doing some work and time just flew. One minute it was like 9 a.m. I blink and it's 1 p.m. How? How? Oh, bottle's in the way. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna take a little lunch break. Cause girl, the time is going too quick for me. But anyways, I'm gonna eat lunch then continue doing some work. And then after, I have a couple things I want to do with you guys. I want to show you guys my gym and my garage. I want to do a Lego. I want to put up the two other posters. And I want to organize more Depop clothes. So, yeah, I'm going to bring you guys along. We're going to do that together. And, yeah, so I'm going to eat lunch, get back to work, and then we will do the fun stuff. Okay. Bye. Hey guys, so I am eating lunch and also today is a full moon. I'm gonna be cleansing my house with some sage um, and just kind of seeing my manifestations and cleansing the house. Um, so yeah, we love a spiritual queen. Hey guys, so I heard the doorbell ring and I got a package. I got a new Lego set. Y'all know my obsession. I got a downtown noodle shop. After I'm done my work, I think I want to build it because it's so cute. And y'all know my goal is to build a Lego town. So yeah, I'm excited. It looks really cute. Looks like that. And I'm going to have to start rearranging the shelf a little bit more because the shelf is really filling up. As you can see, like it's really getting full. So we gonna have to make that work. But anyways, I'm gonna get back to work, but I just wanted to show you guys that. So cute. So cute and so exciting. Love that for me. 
All right, let's do a little bit of work and then we can later get to the fun stuff. All right, just finished doing some computer work. Now I'm gonna take a nice bath. I have so many new bath bombs now, so I'm excited to get into the bath, with some bubble baths and a nice bath bomb. And then I wanna make dumplings for dinner. I wanna put up my posters. I wanna maybe build a Lego, like the noodle shop that I showed you guys. And I wanna organize a couple deep pop clothes. So we kind of have a list going on, but like, are we surprised that I always have something to do? We're not, we're not surprised. Anyways, let's get in the bath. Let's get crunking. Yo, eh. okay, let's go. While I make dinner, I thought I would give you guys a garage gym tour. It is basically complete. I want to get a little bit more of like the gym flooring, but they've been kind of sold out for a while now. But it's basically complete, like I can work out in the gym. So I thought I would share the gym tour with you guys. Before then, I'm going to insert a couple clips of me opening some things. Um, I even opened one of the things that I got for it today. So I'll insert the clips here and then show you guys the gym. So we are in the garage. This is the garage door. Um, if you pan on the left, we just have these hooks that have like cleaning stuff, brooms, rakes, and all that kind of good stuff. Then we have recycling and garbage, which is, I'm showing you the boring part first so that we can get to the good stuff. Then I will give you guys an overview of the gym. Okay, so as you can see, it's nothing crazy, but it has everything that I need to work out and have a good house workout. If you guys didn't know my like workout schedule on Mondays, I do a workout class that isn't at home. And then Wednesdays, I'll be doing a home workout. And then Fridays, I work out with my personal trainer at another gym. So this kind of works for me. It's super cute. Don't mind this box. Um, I will be donating it eventually. But this is my garage gym. Um, and yeah, I'll give you guys a tour. It's not gonna be very long because there's not too much, but it's still really cute. So first starting with the flooring, I got it from Walmart. See, I'm just missing a couple more. Um, and then I have this gym mat. I have this stepper that I got yesterday at Walmart. And this this is gonna be my like cardio machine. We have a couple storage bins and then a yoga mat. And then also a stepper if I wanna do cardio 
and a kettlebell. Then we have this bench here where I can do bench press and all that kind of good stuff. And almost everything is from Walmart actually, Walmart and Amazon. So we have the bench. Then here we have um, my squat rack. I think that's what it's called. Um, I have the barbell that I got from Amazon and the squat rack that I got from Walmart online. I have all the weights and I have the um, spring clips to attach the weights. I got two five pounds, two 10 pounds, and two 25 pounds. And did you hear that voice crack? Let's ignore that. And then we have these little hook thingies so I can put all the weights on there and it kind of keeps the whole thing stable. The bar itself is 17 kilograms, so about 30 something pounds. Um, so yeah, I'll be able to do my squats, my bench presses, my deadlifts, and I can do a decent workout with the equipment that I have. And I got a lot of these on sale on Walmart and Amazon. Then behind me, we have this shelf, which has yoga mats. I have three yoga mats here because I used to do yoga a lot. I used to do yoga a lot. We have my dumbbell weights, five pounds, eight pounds, and 10 pounds. Um, we have, I forgot what this is called, but it's basically to put on the barbell, top your back. We got a massage roller. We got resistant bands, um, wrist weights, massage balls, extra cords, and yoga stuff. So yeah, I love it. Everything's super organized and I can't wait to just work out and continue on my health grind but yeah that is my garage gym um yeah i love it it's nice and also if like i have a car that's coming in here i can just move the squat rack onto that wall and move the chair and fold it up so yeah i might eventually move it on this wall to make it easier if there's cars parking but for now pretty nice pretty good and that is my garage gym hell yeah so yeah that's my gym you guys enjoyed seeing my little gym i know it's not like a crazy gym but also i have everything i need to do a nice workout so it's nice um for dinner i actually decided to use this pasta kit from walmart it's the creamy alfredo it's super quick you do everything in one pot and it's delicious so i just have that cooking up right here um and yeah we're just cooking we're making making things happen I'm going to eat dinner and then I'll get to doing the other stuff. But yeah, I hope now showing you guys the gym and the gym being basically done. There's literally like one. Per the, the house is literally 99.5% done. Um, I am just missing one thing in my office. Basically, I have a backdrop holder and I'm just missing the pole and the backdrop paper. Um, and yeah, so I've been trying to find a good one. Once I find that, it's basically complete and maybe I'll do, maybe my last moving 101 episode might be like an office tour. Um, yeah. And then everything else that has to do with the house will probably be in a Living with Sue episode. Um, but yeah, the house is basically complete and I've been living here for two months now. Yeah, two and a half months now. And it's been great and I've been living my best life and trying new things and living my life to the fullest. So yeah, anyways, I'm going to eat dinner and continue my day and bring you along, of course.
just been actually editing this video um, and watching YouTube videos on my TV. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this Moving 101 episode. I hope you guys enjoyed. This is probably the before last one. The next one will probably be my office room tour whenever my office is done. Just waiting on finishing like the backdrop situation. Once that's done, then the house is 100% done. Like it's literally at 99.5% done. And I was able to do it in about two months, which is obviously very quick, very thankful for my family, my friends, um, you guys for supporting me and just, yeah, and I'm very proud of myself and how far I've come. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I love you guys so, so much. Um, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Prepare yourself for living with Sue content and also Vlogmas and Christmas and holiday content. And I'm so excited and soon, my Christmas tree will be in that corner and I cannot wait. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode slash vlog and I'll see you guys in another video episode or vlog. Bye.